What's going on, everybody? It's Jay Coffee Talk back again with another video for you guys. So check it out, man. We we all know this um, Leaving Neverland documentary dropped, and you know it, it, there's uh, it's a real divide in the public. You know, a lot of people believe Mike's innocent. A lot of people believe he's guilty. Um, I've made some videos on this on my on my channel, you know, and um, I was attacked by a lot of Michael Jackson fans saying, you know, just and I wasn't even saying Mike was guilty. I just was, you know, saying, hey, what does everyone think? And people just really went off on me. You know what I mean? And um, now a lot of people since the documentary has dropped, which I still haven't seen, you know, are getting in my comments and saying, hey, listen, um, it's becoming very clear to me now that Mike is guilty, you know, and then a lot of people are like, man, no, that's what the documentary is meant to do. It's made to look that way. And, and a lot of people are like, man, I don't care. I believe it, period, you know. So I don't know. Get, get in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. And if you did see the documentary, but check it out, man. Rapper the game, if you uh, see the images on the screen here, has come out and defended uh, Michael Jackson. He shared a picture here that says, facts don't lie. This is on Instagram. People do. And it says, innocent on Mike. And then he also, um, and he uh, put the caption, let the king rest. And then he also um, shared, made that his profile picture. He made that his profile picture. So um, with uh, all this going on, you know, it's kind of crazy, you guys. I, I've I've blogged on my um cha on my channel before about how sex offenders are are the lowest of the low to me. I don't even consider them to be human. I consider consider them to be evil, like devil, just demonic, evil, like le lowest form of life on earth. Um, sex offenders and molesters, they truly just disgust me, you know. And um, a lot of people that go through you know different abuse and things like that. We obviously know it has a toll on their, on their, um, my, you know, on their mind and they, they're traumatized by it. Now I wanted to point this out and this is not meant to be disrespectful. So please don't get in my comments talking greasy or whatever like that. Um, the game, cause game has shared this with the public. So it's not like this is something people don't know and I'm putting it out there. Game's father who passed away, um, a year or so ago, I, I believe, or maybe maybe more than a year now, he, you know, game has flat out stated that as a kid, his father molested his sister and, you know, other like his brothers. I don't know if it was his brothers and sisters or just his sisters. I don't even want to think about that. But the point what I'm trying to to make is that game, you know, flat out said that his father was was a pervert and a child molester, you know, and then. It was really strange. A lot of people questioned it. You know, the game later got cool with his father. And, you know, when his father did pass away, he was mourning his death. Really, you know, he took it rough. He was really, really badly mourning. And um, I don't know, guys. Do you think that pertains to this issue at all? Like where game, you know, because he sympathizes with his father, that he sympathizes with with sex offenders or molesters you know what i mean um i don't know as i said this ain't meant to be disrespectful this is shit that the game shared with with you know the public in interviews and things like that uh, go watch the howard center stern go watch the howard stern interview go watch some other documentaries on game he spoke about it a bunch of times and um i don't know you know what i mean like a lot of people i've personally gotten in fights with people like back home you know, uh, in the hood, someone goes upstate. Like, I know someone, and I see them chilling with someone who went upstate for some old sex offender shit. And I'm like, yo, why are you, why are you rocking with him? And they're all like, oh, and they got some bullshit reason. And I'm like, listen, I don't fuck that. You know what I mean? I don't sympath Like, I don't want nothing to do. They get no sympathy for me. Fuck them, them perverts. You know what I mean? So I was just curious to, to know if you guys think that there's any, you know, connection here between the game sticking up for Michael Jackson or, you know what I mean? Um, I don't know, you know what I mean? That his father was a sex offender. Let me know what you guys think. It's Jay Coffee Talk. Till next time, I'm out of here. Peace.